in Congo, I used to live with my mom and dad. I don't remember much because I was young. The only thing I remember is go outside, play with my friends, hang out, go to the lake, swim around. And then we just see like Gansha. We don't even know where it came from. And they say it was like war stuff like that. And my parents is like, we better run away to find a safe place. So we went to Tanzania. And then after that, we went to the refugee camp, me and my brothers and my sister. When I was there, I just saw a lot of people in the camp I didn't know. I was like, what is this place? My brother, they like, we don't even know either. We're just in the refugee camp. My parents, they didn't come. We were like trying to find out where our mama and dad is, but we couldn't find it though because nobody in the camp have the phone. You can't get away from the camp to go anywhere. The first time I got in the refugee camp, they only have one kind of food. And then it was like green beans. I didn't like that kind of food. So if I eat it, I don't know if I was allergic to it, I don't know, I get sick. And then they call ambulance, the people in the camp, and then take me to this different city. It was like a little city. By myself, nobody can come with me. About three weeks, I'll go back. And another week again, I'll get sick. It was terrible. Laughing in the refugee camp is bad. Like, you have to go to forest, find food, come back, cook. Before you want to get water, you have to walk miles away to get water. And then after that, the process came. So we did the interview with immigrant people. One month, they like put our name on the board. And then this lady came to us and be like, you guys are going to America. I was like, so happy. First time I got to the airport here, it's like, wow, this beautiful place. But in my mind, I was like nothing like home in Africa because I wish, that time I was like, I wish my mom and dad were here so we can have like these fun moments together. So our case manager was there too. We smiled back because the English was hard for us to like, when he talk, we only smile. When he smile, we smile back. When he say, how are you? Everybody will say, how are you back? I didn't like the clothes because they were like jackets. I don't like to wear jackets. I don't like to wear sweaters or jackets or stuff like that or mittens. And the food was, oh, that kind of good. I didn't like the food though. Milk, cheese. I'm like, what should I eat? First of all, I'm not a dog. I'm not a cow. So we only cook like African food. My brother will go to like, to a, he will go to African market and he will buy like some food. That time when I come here, everything is gonna be fun. You go outside, play with your friends. But when I got here for one week, two days, I never see anybody. I, I was like, I want to go back home. The school was already closed. It was like in April. They almost done with school, but we went to summer school. They tell us we're gonna go ride the bus, which means I don't know where to go to get the bus. So my brother have to take to me to the bus every day and come pick me up or so, so I can I get lost. I like soccer because you get to know a lot of people. You get to hang out with them. You get to have more friends to talk to. It's just fun. Like if you're really mad, you go to soccer, everything will be really good in your brain. You'll be just thinking about soccer and playing with your friend around. I'm friendly with everybody. I talk to everybody. And that's how life needs to be in there because you never know who's gonna help you in your life if it's not your friends. My first, 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 first dream I want to have is become flat at NS. I want to travel around the world to see how it is, how beautiful it is. And maybe I can get a chance to go back to my country, go visit my families who live there in France because I really miss them so much. You don't care what people think about you. You don't care what people say about you. You just be the, just be you. Like, be who you are, no matter what, they're not gonna change you to a different person. 